Good evening and welcome to everyone taking part in the third and final seminar in our 2021 series on the theme of the relationship between tourists and residents. Thank you again to everyone who's made their way here to this magnificent new LJMU student life building at Copperas Hill in Liverpool's Knowledge Quarter. And thank you again to Dr. Hayes Landers and the LJMU Tourism, Travel, Culture and Heritage Research Group for hosting us so generously for the final two seminars. We are extremely grateful. In our second seminar, Destination Porto, we heard from Anna and Carmo, who told us how their city was pioneering civic decisions based upon creating a sustainable tourism sector in harmony with their residents. However, they made it clear that they still had some way to go with citizen engagement. So tonight, we've come to listen and learn from Destination Copenhagen, just how seriously they have worked with their local resident communities to develop a tourism offer that is genuinely world leading. Our connections to Denmark took a major step forward two days ago when a regular twice weekly flight from Liverpool John Lennon Airport, Mondays and Fridays for those who are interested, was inaugurated. Mm -hmm. We've been very excited about Copenhagen ever since we came across the extraordinary work of Welcome Copenhagen and the documents they produced, which set out the process and guidelines for developing a visitor economy in harmony with citizens and the environment. Eventually, we were put in touch with Peter Roma Hansen, who recommended we connect with his partner and CEO, Signe Jungerstedt at Group Now. Signe is the former Executive Vice President of Wonderful Copenhagen and the person behind their renowned tourism strategy, Localhood, the End of Tourism. This set out their overall policy and process, which was followed by Tourism for Good, another report in 2018. That sets the direction for the development of sustainable tourism in harmony with the UN's Sustainable Development Goals. The contact I've had with Signe and Peter has been inspiring and delightful. They've been extremely generous in supporting what Engage is trying to do in Liverpool through raising the question about the role of residents in the local visitor economy. I'm seriously excited about hearing Signe's presentation this evening and really look forward to the reaction of our audiences, physical and virtual. Following Signe's presentation, I will call upon the members of the local panel from their different perspectives to respond spontaneously to what they've heard. And we're delighted tonight to welcome Mayor Joanne Anderson, who recently visited Copenhagen herself and so has a unique feel for that city as a tourist there. Claire McColgan, who hasn't yet arrived, but is on the way. Claire, unfortunately, has gone to the venue we had at the first seminar. Um, Claire is the director of Culture Liverpool, and she's been at the heart of the city's tourism offer following the year when Liverpool was European capital of culture. And Dr. Hazel Andrews, reader in tourism, culture and society here at Liverpool John Moores University. Then we will open the seminar up to questions from participants, both here and online. We will aim to conclude by 7.30. For our online participants, please ask questions at any time using the chat facility in the Zoom webinar. And let us know your first name and the place where you are. It just helps us understand where people are uh, following us from. We would encourage everyone to tweet tonight using the hashtag Destination Liverpool, and we are at Engage Liverpool. So let's now hear directly from Signe about how tourists and residents are an integral part of the Copenhagen visitor economy. So she should appear any second. So <laughs> can we give a very warm welcome to Signe Jungestad. <laughs> 